Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, my name is Monica, also known as Moni. Um, here I am, finally, video number two uh, with the Vera Bradley Love You Lots collection. So these are items that I purchased myself and um, none of it was sent to me, but always video um, opinions, and or not video opinions, but my opinions on my videos. <laughs> They're always my own. Um, but before we get started in this video, I do want to shout out a Vera Bradley friend of mine, Zena from Warthog Princess. Her YouTube channel is awesome. She does so many videos, not just Vera Bradley. So if that's something you're interested, I suggest you check out her channel. And she's also posting or has posted a Vera Bradley Love You Lots video. So if you're interested in that, I suggest you head on over there so you can get more love is in the air, love you lots, um, Valentine video. So let's go ahead and get started. So first things first, um, the first three items that we're going to discuss, I bought back in November. Um, these items were for sale since then, and I thought they were just so adorable. And I was like, this must be the Valentine pattern. So I needed to pick it up. Obviously, there was no way because I've only been obsessed with one other Vera Bradley Valentine's Day pattern that was Sweethearts and Flowers from a couple years ago. Um, so the first thing is this beautiful mug that I actually plan to display on my coffee bar year round, not just during the Valentine's Day season. It is just so cute. It's a 12 ounce mug. It's a ceramic mug and it is dishwasher and microwave safe as per the little tag here. <laughs> it's all crumpled up, but anyways, y'all get the picture. Super cute. I'm excited to use that and to have it on display year round. I'm going to put that on the ground. The next items, let me just get them both, are items I'm probably not going to use. I bought them because one, I collect stationery, and two, this is just too cute not to buy. You know, um, so let's just go ahead and start with this. So these are Vera Bradley shaped playing cards. They're shaped in a heart, and as you know, the Love You Lots uh, pattern has black, white, purple, and pink hearts on it. It is just so cute. Um, it says it's a set of 54 cards, 3.625 by 3.625 inches, and it does retail for $12.95. I just thought this was so cute. I needed to have this. And lastly is this mini notebook, uh, mini notebook with pocket. It's 160 college rolled pages, and it does have an interior pocket. And if you look closely here on the edge, you do see that it is pink because the pages are like outlined with pink and I want to say like the rolled lines are also pink so I just thought this was really cute to also have on display in an office and just to never use just to appreciate its beauty <laughs> and so let's go ahead and get into like the actual like things that you can wear so y'all know if you follow me on Instagram I do mention my migraines a lot over there um I do suffer from migraine and one of the symptoms that I get with migraine is super cold hands and super cold feet. So whenever I have a migraine attack, I always put on some cozy socks and these are just so comfortable. It says that it's a one size fits most. Um, they're just cozy, look at that. So cute and they're this like really nice like plush material. Super soft to the touch also. And let's do a zip ID next. So I love zip IDs. I only purchase the ones that I truly, truly love. Um, I have so many zip IDs. Um, I should probably do a zip ID collection video, but you know, I haven't yet. Maybe I will. <laughs> so the zip ID has a Vera Bradley ribbon pull tie and it you do get like a little keychain well, loop there. You can like thread your keys in through there. And then your zip ID is your typical organization where you get the zip ID or the ID window pocket area and then the opposite side. I love to use these as wallets. Um, $15, it's, I feel like if you really are obsessed with the pattern and you just can't necessarily afford to grab a whole bunch of things at once but you really want a snippet of the pattern, this is a good way to accomplish that, buying zip IDs. And so next we have this adorable bag charm. It's a heart coin purse bag charm. This one retails for $28. Before we get into this cute shape, I wanted to just easy to miss. You could easily miss that. But there's a little heart on the zipper. I just thought that was such a cute detail. It's not a ribbon pull. And I was kind of like bummed like, oh, well, that's not a ribbon pull, you know. But then when I paid really close attention, I was like, wow, I think I prefer this over the ribbon pull, to be honest. 
Um, and so this keychain part or this, um, for the charm, like the hook part, it does open and close just like that. This is what the interior looks like. Pretty spacious. And my hand is kind of smallish, so it's about the size of the palm of my hand. In comparison to a small viewer tote, that's how big it is. Right there, the pocket area. So we'll get into the small viewer tote in a little bit. Um, next is this heart zip case. It's I want to say this is like a cosmetic. It's not advertised or the, there's not a cosmetic word in the name. But the reason why I think that is because of the lining of this. You do get that um, PVC plastic lining, which is really nice because if you were to spill something, you could easily wipe that off. And you do have a mesh slip pocket right there. And you get a nice wide mouth opening. There are no side gussets. Or anything like that it's just open but you do have about um, like a two to three inch um, width before it hits the bottom of this little pouch and another great thing you also get the same <laughs> easy to miss but it's their little heart on the zipper so I thought that was super adorable let's get into the triple zip hipster um, I am a new lover of the Vera Bradley Triple Zip Hipster. This Triple Zip Hipster wasn't always a favorite of mine because I did not know how to pack my bags. So I felt the way I would pack my bags, it would, the main compartment would always take up space from like the secondary compartment and this third compartment. But I've since then learned how to pack a Triple Zip Hipster and this is actually a really great bag and it looks it lays nicely on the body and it looks nice. It's very, it's like a very figure flattering bag style. Um, and this is the first compartment, which is no organization. It's just a zip compartment. And then the second zip compartment, you do have um, two slip pockets right there. The back side of the bag, you do get a really nice uninterrupted swatch of the pattern. And you do have a slip pocket that does fit an iPhone 12 Pro Max. Here's my phone, and let me grab that and stick that in here so you guys can see. It fits perfectly in there, and there's about, oh, there's a lot of room before it hits the top, so it's hidden in there. The main compartment also has just one organization pocket, and it is a zip pocket. You can see that. Um, I'm trying to like do this. For you guys right there that is what the zipper looks like there's no detailing or anything on the zipper it's just pink um, and it zips really nicely and there you go that's the pocket and this pattern I spoke about it on the last video it's just beautiful I love it I wish I feel like I wish I could stare at this all day or I feel like I could stare at this all day I wish I had the interior as an exterior but I absolutely love the exterior so much. And lastly, well, we have a couple of things here. Let's do the charm first. This charm, I spoke about it in my last video, and this charm is just so cute. Oh, so, so cute. Um, you get three hearts, dangling hearts. Um, you do get this plum, like, raspberry-colored heart, and then this purple heart, and you get this pink one with a bunch of mini hearts inside of it, black and white mini hearts. And then, <laughs> this is just so cute. It's in the shape of a heart. And this is how it opens. It's adorable. So, anyways, let me just hook this back. I wasn't going to hook it, but then I figured, let me just hook it so you can see how adorable that looks on the bag. So that is what it looks like on a bag like the Vera Tote or the small Vera Tote. This is a small version. Let me grab this heart pouch and attach it to the opposite side. Let's see. And that's what that looks like there. So you guys can see what that looks like. It is so cute. So this is a small Vera tote, um, another Vera Bradley fan favorite. Um, it does have a 12 inch strap drop that is 
what it looks like on me. You can see right there. It's kind of hard to really show because I'm, I'm not fully in frame when I stand. But your small rear tote, if you're familiar with this, um, you get your standard um, slip pocket there and you have a zip pocket here. You also have this hidden uh, top, hidden slip pocket. Um, I like to throw my keys or my phone in there. Sometimes my mask will go in there too. It just depends. Depends on what I'm feeling that day. Um, and then when we get to the interior, you do have your standard six slip pockets in the back and the front. And that is a really nice um, wide mouth opening to your bag. And that pattern is just oh so lovely. And that pretty much sums up everything, guys. I am so excited about all of this. All of these are styles I've had before and have used, well, the bag-wise. I am excited to use this little um, charm. I don't know what I'm going to use it for, but I'll use it for something. And um, this, too. Totally excited to use that. This would also just look cute to sit like on your vanity just for fun. Adorable. And yeah, guys, so thank you guys for tuning in and for watching and for being patient with me and like doing YouTube because this is all new to me. And like I mentioned, if you haven't checked out uh, Xena Warthog Princess's video, I suggest you go do that now and subscribe to her channel. And well, what the heck, subscribe to mine too. <laughs> but thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye!